What's up guys, go back to a brand new video man. Today we got some rumors about patch update 1.19 and WWE 2K23. Let's dive into this. So I believe free DLC superstars uh, will become a patch update 1.19. Now this is a long shot here, but the rumors out there, Mandy Rose. Um, it's probably just because of the fact that everything's in her in there for the uh, Mandy Rose or her files in the game as well. Her interest in the game, the trio interest in the game, what ties to the attraction. But this is a very long shot like the rumors could be wrong but i just put baby rose in here just for the sake that she could be covered patch up day 1.19 so watch the rest of her entrance man when we get into the second superstar She has stolen the show on many occasions and i think she's planning on doing it again here tonight Oh, yeah, I am pumped for this guy. And her partner from Charlotte. All right, guys, unless we got Ric Flair. Ric Flair has everything in the game from his Wu Taunt to his, you know what I'm saying, to his uh, attire, to his the files, to his entrance. Everything from Ric Flair is in the game. Um, so he's a long child as well, but I thought the rumors out there could be wrong on this one but i'll just put it in this video just for the sake rick flair is one of the powerful superstars people want to see back in the game Woo! don't know why he took it out this year doesn't make any sense to me but hey he's one of the free dlc superstars rumored to be a patch of date 1.19 so it has all his hidden taunts his voice uh acts as well so just watch the rest of his itches we can talk about the next two superstars and more in the gameplay He said he'll be making a statement in this match tonight and will deliver it emphatically. Woo! And from the Welsh Valley. All right, next up we got Tegan Knox, man. Tegan Knox is one of the free DLC superstars who to be a patch update 1.19. And why I th think this is true because we're due to for a huge patch update. Uh, just because of the fact that we have had a huge patch update in a while. And it's about time W comes through. Now, with Tegan Knox, she's disappeared on the main event. She's on Raw tonight as well. Um, her storyline started tonight as well. So I feel like it would be a great opportunity to include Tegan Knox as a free DLC superstar. Uh... This is our updated attire as well. Got for community creations. So watch the rest of her inches. We're going to talk about the next superstar. She certainly knows how to get a reaction. And she'll get an even bigger one when she wins this match. Now, the next superstar is The Fiend. Okay, I've talked about this before. You guys said, I don't know what you guys are talking about. I don't see it. I'm going to show you guys again. Look, The Fiend has everything in the game for his fetus interest motion championship. So, the fetus uh, character from the. When you download The Feed uh, for community creations, it pops up in the community. In the uh, download the superstars tab with the DLC tab. I'm going to show you guys that in this video as well. It just pops up randomly. It's not random, but it's like it pops up. To where it acts like it's DLC for the game, you know what I'm saying? You guys can see right here, his whole motion is great to the game. He has his championship motion to the game. He has his, you know, mask in the game. He has outfit in the game. He has files in the game. The commentary is in the game as well. Everything's for the feeds in the game. The files is there. All they gotta do is add the feed in there. It'll be good to go. I don't know why they don't add the feed. It would just make perfect sense for it to be a free DLC superstar for patch update 1.19. And again, guys, we're due to it for a huge patch update. These last few patches have been kind of small. Nice little touches here and there, but it's not nothing drastic. You know what I'm saying? We're due for a huge one. So hopefully they deliver a patch update 1.19, which comes out very, very soon. Uh, they usually do two patch updates so a month now, especially with AEW dropping DLC and stuff like that. But uh, yeah, this is the feed right here. Uh, check out his full entrance and this is with the championship interest as well just because of the fact that it has the fetus interest motion already in the game 
and it has the feed as downloadable content. If you download again, if you download for what status you have a bit of your game, it pops up on the downloadable content tab already. You know what I'm saying? So what you guys are watching the rest is intro, which is pretty cool. You can see he has his championship right here. Uh, he takes off the championship and then he does the you know, interest motion as well, which is dope. So watch the rest of this. We're gonna talk about more of the gameplay and I'm gonna show you guys what I'm talking about with the downloadable content with the feed. Also, you can see the lights in the background has cool effects as well, man. It just everything with the feed, it just makes more sense. It just makes sense that he's in the game for, he's in the next update for patch update 1.19. All right. So now we see the interest. Let's get into the gameplay. Now with Tegan Knox, his her storyline starts tonight on Monday Night Raw. So it'll be a perfect opportunity for W to capitalize on putting her in the game for free. You know what I'm saying? Now Mandy Rose is a long shot. I just put it in there because of the rumors out there, uh, but Mandy Rose is definitely a long shot to be in the game. Ric Flair should be already included this year. I don't know what happened to Ric Flair. I think he re-signed his legend contract, so that's why he wasn't in this year's game. But that makes sense, just because of the fact that when she don't sign a legend contract, you're not going to be in the game. Like, the Bella Twins is probably the last time that you see them in the video game because this is the last legend contract uh, they signed. So, I don't think they'll be in next year unless WWE does something where they keep all legends in. But, I don't think they'll do that. But... Uh, for Ric Flair, he shall automatically be in the game. It makes no sense. They have everything for him, for his Wu taught to everything, man. To his attire, his files are in the game as well. It just makes no sense. Now, for the feed, I'm sure you guys what I mean for the feed, okay? It has everything for the feed. No cap. Like, from the interest motion to the title motion to the victory motion, it has everything. See what I'm saying? Like, even has, uh,. Commentary for the feed as well. If you have the DLC pack, it has commentary for the feed, so it just makes no sense. Bro. It makes no sense how the feed's out there. Now, for uh, Mandy Rose, is a long shot, but there's little bits of commentary in there for Mandy Rose. You, if you use Otis, there's little bits of commentary for her as well. But uh, yeah, these superstars just make sense for patch update 1.19. Again, guys, we're due for a huge patch update, so hopefully this comes true. The rumors are true out there. But yeah, what do you guys think about these four superstars that are being rumored to be a patch update 1.8T that's free DLC superstars? Let me know in the comments down below. Uh, again, we're three subs away from 7,600 subscribers. Bro, if you are new to the channel, hit that sub button for me, man. We're on the road to 8K. We're hitting 8K very, very soon. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah, we we almost there. we almost there. So. Again, thank you guys for watching this video. Make sure you drop a like on the video, subscribe, turn on your post notifications, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.